Referee is set to drop the puck on this one. Rosters are ready alongside Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski, ready to call all the action in this one. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. The bench warmers take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. And now it's over to Markov. Look out! What a hit! You gotta keep your head up out there. Moves it quickly over to Howard. Handles it along the blue line. Shot denies him on the play. Simmons scoops it up from the back of the cage. Big stop by the keeper. No time to take a breath. He made that first stop, and then the puck turns around on him again. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And that pass is stolen. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. And the officials stop the play. Let's see what the call is. There's a tough call to take here. Interference is the call, Ray. Battling away for the puck, you end up taking a little bit too much of a liberty and you get whistled for interference. And the man advantage unit comes out to go to work. Well, there hasn't been much to choose from in the two teams so far. The game is still scoreless, of course. But here's a power play. You've got a chance to change that in the next couple of minutes. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. Too much traffic in the lane. From the place 99 made famous. Comes up with the stop. Quick feed to Brown. Toronto's got the puck shorthanded. Here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end. And he moves the puck across the blue line out of the defensive zone. That's intercepted. Howard's got it across the line. Knocks the puck loose. Huge steal in his own end. And the penalty killing unit doing work. Excellent kill as we're both back to even strength. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through their fingers. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. And he's able to handle that one. Simmons has the puck from the back of the cage. And it's a quick pass to Markov, and manages to clear the zone. Wide of the net. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. There's the whistle icing the call. And a challenge being thrown down here. Yeah, that came out of nowhere a little bit, and the challenge is down. And the puck leaves the zone. And now he angles it across to Carter. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Quick feed to Howard. Niagara Falls has it in the offensive end. Off the post! Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Works it across to Carter. It's a three on one. Slides it across. Niagara Falls gains a hold of possession. Uncle Larry's got it in the defensive end. Here's a chance to move the puck outside the zone. Gets it out of his own end. Picks it off, look out! And down he goes as the puck goes free. Over the line they come. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Niagara Falls gets a hold of it. Oh, reads it perfectly, here's a chance. Makes the save, what a reaction with the blocker. Pretty solid stop and the puck goes into the corner to safety. He got all of that hit. Quick pass to Bear. Passes on over to Simmons. Sends it over to Carter. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Howard's gonna go off for a pair for charging here. I think the only question there was whether it was gonna be two or five for that charging penalty. 
Here's a first look at the power play. Well, to this point, the game... Some pushing and shoving here, heating up. Yeah, the few words lead to a little bit more, it looks like. Too many bodies in the way. He's got a little jump. He's in all alone. Oh. Scores! Not the special teams unit we expected to deliver. No, this is a real turning point in the game here as the shorthanded group capitalizes, gets on the board. Hey, James, I thought the goalie had this still about the fourth beak. And then he's out in the corner. He's got no chance. What a goal. Niagara Falls takes the 1-0 lead as they come up with a big-time goal here in the late stages of the opening frame. I like the way their bench reacted too, James. Once they sat back down, they're talking about going to get a second one to stay on the front foot. Niagara Falls gains possession under man. Can't connect, and that one stopped. Niagara Falls gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Slides the puck near the front of the net. And he comes up with it. High quality chance, high quality save. They've got numbers. It's a two on one. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Nice hit on the play there. The bench warmers gain control of it. And player hauled down to the ice. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here. Here comes the call. Brown's getting called for two minutes here by the officials. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Uh, he's digging around for the puck, and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Niagara Falls gains control of the puck. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Gets the puck back here in the neutral zone. Battling for the puck, but still hangs on. Here's a short pass to Markov. Moves it around along the half wall. Puck lands back onto a stick. Oh, what a save on the one-timer! Just here in the late stages of this frame, one nothing is where we sit at this point. He's looking for a dance partner. Yeah, he looks like he wants somebody, anybody to, to engage with. Save made by the goalie. Gets it out of his own end. Batted down out of midair. They've got numbers to his teammate, and that's picked off. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. We've got a minor penalty coming up For here sure, on this one. James. I mean, this call was going to be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're going to have to serve two minutes. Face off and another opportunity to take and stir in the pot here after the whistle. Yeah, a little friction and all of a sudden guys are getting heated. It's an opportunity for the power play unit to go to work now as the penalty expires. With possession along the wall. Shot, what an opportunity, he puts it high. Looking to pop the water bottle off the top of the net. He shoots it too much over the top. Puck picked up in the open ice. All smart heads up play to poke that one away. Well, that'll do it for an entertaining opening 20 minutes of hockey as the horn sounds. one nothing is the score as both teams make their way to their respective rooms. Still to come, we'll be right back with much more action here on EA Sports. Teams are back at center ice, and we are ready to get period number two underway. Toronto's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. Sends it ahead to Brown. Brown 
Evans got it in the offensive zone. That's a great heads up play to break up the pass. Sends the pass over. They've got numbers. Takes a wrist shot. He scores. I believe a colleague of ours likes to call those back to back. Yeah, the coaches want you to stay aggressive after you score. They do that, and they're able to put another one up on the board. Once you get the goalie down, you better not give him another chance. The shooter sticks this right up into the top of the net. Perfect goal. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Scored by number 13. Dunlop's moving the puck through his own zone. One minute, five seconds. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Shot gets in front of it. Moves it to Simmons. Takes the feed at the point. And now he tries to get it across to Brown. Picks it off in the offensive end. And he makes the save. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Niagara Falls continues to lead by a pair of goals. Puck picked up by Dunlop. Niagara Falls takes possession of the puck. And he can't hang on after that hit. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Sends it across the ice. Passes it over to James. Niagara Falls has it in the open ice. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. And he regains control of the puck. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. And there's the whistle. Let's get the call from the official here. Point us going off for charging. I didn't like that hit. You can see how he was angry with the way that he was hit. Now his opponent goes to the box for two. Ray, you could see that one coming from a mile away. He scores! Ah, the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely, and they're able to capitalize on the extra man. The bench warmers are back to center ice, and they have narrowed that gap. Cut the lead in half. The comeback's on. Now they must push forward, see if they can get the equalizer. Slides the puck to Dunlop. Carter's taking it from his own end and tries to make a diagonal pass to Markov. Gets the puck back onto a stick. Niagara Falls gets the puck near the boards. Here they are on the attack. Quick snap, and his goaltender's not going to like that one as he scores, putting it into his own. Well, you don't see that every day. He turns around to clear the puck, and he rifles it past his own goaltender. Whoops. Niagara Falls has found another goal here in the second. They're up by a pair. Important goal, too. Now, just look at the way the game changes here. If they give up the next one, they're tied. Now, they've got a little cushion. Dished on over to Markov. A little rock em, sock em on the play. Niagara Falls looks to move the puck from their own end. Brown stick handling in his own zone. Niagara Falls has it along the wing up the neutral zone. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Interference is the call here, Ray. If he moves his feet just a little bit more, he's in better position. Niagara Falls will try to kill a few seconds off this penalty. With the stop. Hey, that means the play's supposed to end here. They're still pushing around pretty good. Carter's turning this challenge down. That's not part of his game. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Oh, he's calling him out. Did he ever? This is, this is going to get heated. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Gives up the body to block the shot. Voidas lugging the puck. Nice pass. And we've got a two-on-one. Sends it across. Quick pass to James. Taken by Brown. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Quick pass across to Markov. And that slides right out to center ice. Solid shorthanded performance there as both teams are now back to even strength. Sometimes you go on the ice with the best of intentions and it goes all wrong right away. That's how I characterize that power play. 
With the steal. Looks to start the transition game behind the net. Handles the bank pass from along the boards. Dishes it to Carter. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Well, the officials have tried to keep things in line, and yet another penalty call here. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the pocket, he gets a stick caught in their feet. Marcos won it in their own end. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. Past the halfway mark of this period. It's a two-goal lead we're looking at with the score 3-1. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. The bench warmers have possession shorthanded. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And makes the routine save. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Play blown dead. Penalty coming up here. Pretty cut and dry trip on that play. Coaches will tell you, be careful with your stick, but you're trying to get the puck. Yeah. I don't think a lot of times they do it intentionally. A little more room out there with a little four on four. This is the time, James, you get your skilled guys into the game more frequently. Four on four is open ice. It's danger if you have skill. And the team with the most... He scores! Jumps on the rebound and makes it count. Toronto's back to center ice, and now it is just a deficit of one. What a difference just the one goal makes in the way that you look at the game, what makes you think is possible. They only need one more to even this up. With some momentum driving towards the net. And there it is, but wait a second, they're waving this one off. I don't think this should count either, James. The play is waved off immediately. It's hard enough to score, and now you lose one. That's goalie interference. It, it, I think it's pretty clear, James. Yeah, let's take one more look and see what the officials didn't like here. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Takes it across the blue line. And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now on the man advantage. Another stop by the goaltender. Here in the later stages of this period, the bench warmers have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to even the score. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Oh, he's trying to shoot that off the glass, James. Under a little bit of pressure, he panics, shoots it over the window. Now he's got to go feel shame for two minutes. <laughs> then you go free after that, right? Toronto Buck has dropped, and we are back underway. Two minutes for delay of game. Time of the penalty. Uncle Larry's got the puck in his own zone. Up along the wing. Carries it in. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Takes the feed. Shuts him down. An opportunity for some power play time now as he steps back out onto the ice. Niagara Falls has possession of it now. Now over to Bear. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. A chance in front. Misses over the net. He misses by a large margin. He's right in the middle of the ice. And he passes it up ahead to Carter. Both sides back to even strength. A great effort by the penalty killers there. Gets more and more power frustrating each power that play end. that slips away in a particular game. Breakaway! Oh, the puck was like an anchor for the forward. He's got a breakaway, but he gets caught from behind. And now he moves it to Markov. Here's an odd man rush. From point blank! And with just seconds to spare, they get a goal here to close things out. You gotta look at it from both ways. That's a real kick in the pants for the team that gave up the goal. But what a boost of energy for them to score this late in the period. I can't imagine they thought this was even possible. They played so poorly early in the game. They've worked their way all the way back to tie the score. Puck grabbed by Simmons. Lays the body. 
Here's a shot. Big time stop. Gets a blocker on it. Tempers flaring. Yeah, a little bump together, a little friction. Looks like the guys want to get it going. There's the horn to end period number two. Still tied 3-3. Three, three. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James, and we are ready to kickstart this third period. It's been a throwback to 80s hockey here, and we are underway here in the third. Here they come on the attack. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. He grabs the puck here at the point. Voida's got it in the defensive end. Handles the puck. Let's get the official decision. Pretty cut and dry with a tripping call here. Yeah, but James, every player argues the tripping call because you feel like your stick was in the right place and the other guy stepped on it. Never your fault. And it looked like there was some late moment lobbying there and it didn't yeah, work. it doesn't work. No, though. none. They'll go back to work on their special teams. You gotta have a short memory on a power play. You haven't scored yet tonight, but that can't matter on this one. Get the puck back to the point, start moving it around and get people converging at the net. And now it's over to Brown. Move to the middle. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. Here comes the official's decision. Brown's called for tripping, he's off to the box. Always a little careless to get a tripping penalty. You get your stick into the player's feet. When he goes down, you're going to go to the box. As we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. Well, the face-off, of course, is pretty critical. You're not going to have as many scrums four-on-four, -four, so if you get the puck first, you're going to get it and hold it. Tries to feed it over to Dunlop. Picked up along the boards by Dunlop. Markov's moving the puck through his own zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. That's broken up in the neutral zone. Penalty expires and the PP unit gets set to go to work. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play and manages to clear the zone. Play whistle dead because of an offside. We're still in the early stages of this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck scooped up by Simmons. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. He's got a step. Oh, what a stop. He scores. In the Hang on. Wait a second here, Ray. Yeah, I, I, this is this is good. Waved off on the ice. We'll have to take a look to see whether this is a distinct kicking motion or not. Several different views, this goal will count. 
Niagara Falls has gone ahead here by one as they make their way back to the face-off circle. Do you like what they've been doing here? I do, and I like the fact that they've stayed aggressive. Now the key will be, can they continue to play like that? And the linesman calls icing on the play. Nearing the midway mark of the period, Niagara Falls leads by one. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Picks it off, they go back on the attack. James brings it in, sends it over, and he can't get it off. Directs it on over to Brown. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Moves it quickly over to Howard. Skates in behind the cage. Knocked away. And now he angles it across to Dunlop. And now it's grabbed by Simmons. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. And the officials will pass the sentence here. Bears go into the box for tripping. Uh, you see he hangs his head and heads towards the penalty box. It's always a frustrating penalty to take. Look at this, he's calling him out here, Ray. Yeah, he wants to go. He's not very happy. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. Takes a shot! Oh, what a save in front! And that's another power play marker! Uh, the power play coach is going to be pumped here. They had done some extra work on the power play over the last 10 days or so. Really paying off tonight. Toronto's counterpunched back to even things up in the third. There were times it looked like they weren't going to get back to this point, but now you've made it a sprint to the finish. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Puck picked up by Simmons. Oh, just a textbook hit. Picks up the puck in his own end. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Moves it over to Carter. Quick feed to James. Look out, a two-on-one. Niagara Falls tries to break out from their own end. Gets it out of his own end. Levels him with the hit. Taken by Carter. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Slides the puck across to Brown. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Brown's got it along the wing. Brown's got it behind the net. Here's a chance right out in front. Howard's gonna play it against the half wall. And he slides it quickly to Uncle Larry. And that banks off a stick. Right up the gut, here they go. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Niagara Falls gains a hold of it. Howard's moving it ahead. Here's the pass. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. And he moves it up to Brown. Dunlop's taking it from his own end. Gets the puck over to James. Moves the puck. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. Simmons moves it into the attacking end. Good hit. Quick pass to Howard. From the neutral zone now. On the attack along the boards. Look at the Savardian spinorama. Way too much congestion blocks that. Niagara Falls has it in the open ice. Picked up along the wall by Brown. Brown's got it against the boards. Puck grab by Brown. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Carries it across the line. It's a two on one. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Scooped up along the wall by Brown and manages to clear the zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Jocelyn for the puck and it's knocked away. And now he passes up to Bear. Offside the call and we'll have a face off just outside the blue line. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone face off. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Takes control of the puck. And that one's stolen at center ice. Grabs control of it at the point. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Moves the puck along the half wall. Slides it quickly to Brown. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Here's a short pass to Markov. Dropped him in the open ice. 
Sends a pass over. And that goes off the post and out. There's the horn to signal the end of the third period. We are still tied. Time is just moments away. Anticipation ramping up in this barn. You can just feel it right now. Moment of truth for both sides. Sudden death overtime. Let's get it on. Great reactionary save on that chance. Brown's got the puck. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Moves it to Markov. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Slides it over with pace to Brown. Excellent stick work on the play. And now he tries to get it across to Uncle Larry. Gets a piece of it with the blocker. Taken along the wall by Carter. The bench warmers have it now. Puck moved over to Markov. Picks it up, and they turn on the pressure. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Look at this, pushing and shoving after the whistle. Yeah, it got heated up pretty quickly. James plays it now. Slides the puck over to Markov. And that goes off course with the stop. A critical draw here. Lot of John back and forth here. It's a rever. I mean, the guys look like they're pretty agitated. There it was! He misses the net. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Moves the puck behind the net. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Loose puck battle along the boards. Howard stick handling in his own zone. And play continues here. Pass back to the point. Here's a chance on the doorstep. And that one's broken up. Gets it out of his own end. From the top of the offensive zone here. The arms up, there's the whistle, and boy, look at the time here for a penalty coming up. Wrong place, wrong time, I guess. Sometimes you gotta say, I'm in the wrong spot and let the guy go, but he tried. And a challenge being thrown down here. Yeah, that came out of nowhere a little bit, and the challenge is down. Carter's got it into offensive territory. Niagara Falls has it in their own zone. Musa quickly over to Bear. Now a quick pass to Brown. Trying to get back on the attack now. From his own end, he picks up the puck. With possession along the wall. Into the corner of the attacking area. Good check, frees the puck up. Quick feed to Howard. And that's blocked. Niagara Falls takes possession along the wall. Power play expires, and what a blown opportunity here in overtime. Oh, Turns it aside. What an opportunity missed there, James. A power play in overtime. They can't cash in, and we go back to even strength. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. 
Niagara Falls gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Niagara Falls has it behind the net. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. A chance to get it out. And that's a big defensive play with that clearing. Yeah, you got to focus on it, James. It seems like an easy play, but that puck has to go up. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Big time save on a big time shot. Tripped up on the play, delay penalty coming up. Dunlop's lugging the puck. Directed over to Carter. Here comes the call from the official. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there, a stick between the player's feet. As we're about to drop the puck, more pressure on this critic. Tensions rising. Didn't take much to get this heated up. That's blocked. Big time stop. Oh, and another big stop. Quick work, he makes one and two saves in a row. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. There it is! There it is! They score to win it in overtime! A big overtime win. Did you ever have an OT winner? Yeah, I had a couple of them. They're fun. I'll tell you, you know that you've ended it all, and when the guys come to pile on you, you can see how happy they are. They want to go home, too.